Hello and welcome back. If you're just joining me, uh, my name is Hoon. My channel is all about making better coffee at home. So this morning, I'm going to show you guys how to back flush your Brista Pro at home. It's going to be very easy and very simple. And so let's get going. Make sure before you're cleaning your machine, fill your water to the max line. Okay, so only thing you need is uh, some cleaning tap. I'm gonna put the link down below. So I'm using, it's called Sipitsa. Uh, so this one is about $8, and she lasts for a long, long time. And then what else you need? Uh, back of your tray, you are going to use a single basket. It comes with a rubber sear, okay? So we're gonna use that. And also, you could use, by the way, I, I'm personally, I hate to read the manual, okay? So that's the reason why I made this video for you guys. If you don't like to read the manual, just watch this, okay? You know, it's, it takes about one minute to figure out. It's a very, very simple process. Uh, anyway, just get the single basket, put the rubber gasket on the top, and then take your uh, single tap here, tablet. Just put it right on the middle, okay? Just like so. Put your single, lock it in. Now take your pore filter with your cleaning tap on. Just lock it into your coffee machine. Once pori filter is in and secure, and simply go to the menu cycle, press the menu button, use the dial to here, and then go up, click flush. And then this time, only thing you gotta do is press the button. And single button, just press it. And it's gonna be takes about five minutes. In progress. Very simple. By the way, don't worry about what is not coming out from the pore filter here. The thing is, water is going to come out on the back. There we go. As you saw, so all the the back flush is cleaning right now. Cleaning the this uh, cleaning cycle, and then let's see here. So it's, it's in progress. You just wait about another three minutes and thirty seconds, and we should be good to go. So see you in about three minutes. Cleaning cycle is over. Just simply remove your pore filter. And now everything's all, nothing there. Okay, so here's the thing about the uh, uh, cleaning uh, cycle or flush or uh, back flush cycle. If you see any kind of uh, detergent left, those tablet left, uh, proper manual say they recommend do the cycle one more time. Just make sure all the deter detergents are all gone, okay? So, and now, only thing we gotta do is just wipe it down clean and we should be good to go. So now all the cleaning cycles are all done. So, so here's all the water come out from the cleaning cycle. You know what, Let, let's take a look at how dirty my machine was. So this is how much come out. It's not too bad, okay? A little murky there, but it's not too bad. So anyway, so I think every like couple hundred cycles, if you use a Brista Pro, just like Brista Express, the automatically the, uh, the light should be turned on by the, they indicate you, you have to do the flush cycle. So I, I know some people does that every other week. And personally, I just wait till those lights come on, but I mean, it doesn't, it, it doesn't hurt the machine, let's put it that way. I know some people does at least once a month or so. I know some of you 
if you are drinking maybe one cup of day, it may take a while, okay? You're gonna see the light, so. Anyway, I hope uh, this video helps. I'm gonna put the link down below how to buy this. I mean, I got from Amazon, so I'm gonna put the link down below for you as well. Uh, if you have any question or comment, uh, please down below. Make sure to uh, subscribe my channel if you haven't, uh, if you haven't done it. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and see you guys next time.